No pass for you. All right. Hello guys. Today I'm going to show you how to reset the Samsung Galaxy S2. This is the T-Mobile um, version. All right. Now I'll take out the battery. So all you simply do is just slide in the battery. Now to reset this, you can see it's a T-Mobile edition. You're going to hold down volume up and down. You're going to press the power button. When it vibrates once, you're going to let go off only the power button. And it's going to boot into the factory, the mode in which you can actually factory reset it. We're going to wipe this device because we have um, several apps crashing. All right. So we'll go straight ahead. The battery is in. I'm going to hold down the power button. You can see on screen here. Starting to boot. And as soon as you feel the vibration, you just simply let go only holding the volume up and down button at the same time all right as you can see we are now in the factory mode and as usual what you're going to do is you're going to wipe the cache partition um, you're going to use volume up and down to navigate use power button to select all right and as you see here it says i'll just wipe the cache now we're going to actually wipe the entire phone now so it's going to select um, wipe data and factory reset so again we're going to use power button to select it's going to verify you know, go down to delete all data that's the option all the way down here use the power button to select and in a few seconds it's going to erase everything on the phone if you have a memory card in here it won't affect anything on the memory card it will only erase the data that's on the phone itself so once we reboot as you see the first option it's going to reboot and once it reboots it's going to basically run you through the setup just as when you just got the phone for the first time so see now it's saying rebooting right so if you're having issues with crashing apps or anything like that the phone is now totally wiped it will run you through the basic setup you can see samsung galaxy s2 4g um, initial boot it will take a little while extra little extra time to start up just getting stuff ready all right so as you see now the device is fully up um just running through initial setup and 